Hello hero guys, today I want to show you something important and um, that is how to catch rate, how to find the difference between dates. We always think that Excel add numbers, subtract numbers and deal with numbers but we don't think that we just have to catch rate some differences or to add some days in date on date and let now see how we can just catch rate the difference between date in Microsoft Excel how to find it yeah let me for example use the today formula in just once you want to to see the date of today there is a function that we use you can just go to formulas and use today formula or you can just you can just use equal sign and type today today uh, open the parenthesis and you cross you click enter and you get the date of today today is yeah you have just 10th june 2022 and this is it today and today you can just use this function or this formula to find the date of today and this is different from now now once we use now the now that we have seen in the previous video how to find the date on the time now somehow they are different because now also gives you the time once we just put equal sign in now we open parenthesis and you cross you are now given date but you're also given time 11 12 and about today gives only it gives you gives you only the date and that is what i want i want just a date and maybe i want to catch rate or to find how many days are remaining to to reach my wedding my wedding anniversary or my birthday maybe let's suppose if my birthday is for example uh takes place maybe 13 yeah 14 and, uh, 14 let me take november um 14 november this year 2022 and let me catch you the difference how many days are there xr is very wide it's very uh, smart media to receive it's it, that it's the date that you are doing the difference on let me just equal sign let me take yeah this date and minus this date and see how many days you see now it has minus sign because i took i just took the the day i, I just took yeah this minus this and i just have i had to take this minus this to avoid the minus sign now equal i just have to take this minus this one minus you just hit minus key this one and equal now you see the days that are, that are remaining remaining 100 157 157 these are the days that are remaining to yeah to the to my yeah to my anniversary this is my birth maybe it's my birthday and this is how you just catch rate how many days you can take any date and see how many days are remaining from today up to the day that you want and guys Excel is very smart. It can deal with the different kind of numbers, different kind of your know, figures. And let me, you can even add, for example, you can even add date. Also, Excel can do it. Excel can do it. I can just add date. Add days to date. You can just add days. Let me show you how to do it. Maybe to this date. To this date, I just want to add maybe. Uh, maybe 60 days let me i just have to equal sign to this date i want to add a number of days let me just take 60 and click equal and see when to you see adding 60 days on this date i'll be next year 
January 13, you see. Excel is very smart. And guys, this is how you can use today function and another date, another date, any date you can take to calculate the difference between difference between two dates and how you can just see if you have a meeting if you have something important in within uh, next 60 days next 90 days next 14 days you can just take any date and add a number of days maybe if i just think that i have uh, i just want to count days if i want maybe i just want uh, to see the next meeting maybe there is two months ago there is two months in the next days i just have to catch rate you see i can just take this again cool i take this and add maybe 90 days this is three months then the future three months i click ok and see the date you see now i will be in this month and this date i can just calculate it and mark your date on your calendar you can mark the date on your calendar once you know the number of days that we are just going to to wait for guys this is how you can just use excel to calculate the difference between dates to add days to date and i hope you enjoy this video and guys don't just take time to go to your calendar while you have a computer while you have excel just do it like this it's very easy it's very easy to do it guys see you next time